All right, boys, the weekend wipe has hit. All of our explosives from last week are gone. We need to make the most out of what we have here in the beginning. We need to get a jackpot here soon so that we can be set for the rest of the wipe and eventually do some clans. We're starting small right now, just searching for profit, like I said, but I have found an armored base. Looks like it just has a few doors on it next to this sheet metal bunker too. Maybe we can hit both of them if we get some profit here. But check this one out, all armor, it's just a two by one with an airlock looks like. Armored door in the front as well. So we've got a few C4 to do this with. Could blow straight into the back. But like I said, let's try to make the most of this C4, go for profit and take the cheapest pathway in here. So I guess the possibility of one, two, three armored doors here. We've got enough to do it as long as it's not walled off with armored. Oh, shotgun trap. Is it of ammo? I think it's out of ammo. What? At least it is an armored door and it's not sealed off just yet. It's one more possibility where it could be sealed off. Holy frick. There's like six shotgun traps in there. Did it bring rockets for this? Can we sneak a C4 past these traps? Ooh, this isn't looking good. I think it might clip onto that furnace, but at least the furnace will get destroyed and it is a garage door. We're gonna have to waste the C4 on this. Perfect toss there. We'll wait for that to go off and hopefully kill those furnaces. We'll get an easier toss after. Actually got a hit marker there. Okay, let's keep going. Oh my god, we have two airdrops coming in right next to us. We're about to get countered. We need to hurry this up. Holy crap, look at those traps. There's like 10. Is that TC? It is. How are we going to get there, though? We can shoot that TC out, hopefully, without getting countered. And place the door up. I bet that guy's coming straight over here after this. Let's get a TC down. Okay, I guess we don't have to worry about the traps anymore. Detox the evil. Let's actually throw up a few more doors. I have a feeling this guy's coming by us pretty soon here. Um, yeah, we can't place him. But <laughs> that's pretty epic. Is there... Is this just a trap base? I have a feeling there's not going to be much in here. Boxes aren't looking too good. We still got that TC. Luckily, we only used, what, 64 in this thing? Not half bad. Need to see some sulfur. Can we even get to the back? Bro, is this really necessary? Come on, there we go, four rockets, kind of worth it. Still need to see some sulfur for it to be profit. Let's go. Okay, I mean, that's, we're almost breaking even on that one. If I would have known this was some bizarre trap base, wouldn't have raided it, but hey, you never know. Can't complain about getting a bit of our stuff back there. I thought he was going to be broke for sure. We'll try to find something a little bit more profitable after this. All right, so this is what our first trip is looking like on the way out of here. Had a few AKs from it. Not bad. Let's go find something else. Okay, I laddered up into the compound on this base. I was trying to check it out without bringing C4 just yet. But it looks like my boy screwed up his honeycomb very badly. <laughs> check out what this is looking like. Totally misplaced the foundations there. I mean, you can't get in. Well, you can actually. But anyways, the front door was missing as well. And this thing was actually not decaying, but there was still an armored door and doorway. This looks like something that we could score pretty big off of, or at least get some profit. It is a solo player, so you can't expect much from it, but you can be surprised with these solo players. I'm gonna bring back in some C4. This should be okay to defend from counters. We can ladder off the door. Maybe put some roofs up there on the top. And we should be able to hear wind counters are coming in. Okay, so we should be able to get in and out of this one pretty quick, considering there's only going to be a few doors to the core, at least I'm assuming. Looks to be that way. So I guess we ladder this door off. And is there any way we can make it safe up here? I guess he would have done it if he could have. I mean, that's sort of okay. Um, you can still kind of get in here without shooting it down, but we'll have to do that. This honeycomb just is not very optimal. 
Let's go for C4 on this door and see what he's got. Okay, let's actually do this too. Yeah, looks like it's heading over to the left there. Um, we'll keep going with C4. Double door here and a box. All right, pretty juiced up so far. And what is this airlock? Looks like it could be going all the way around as a bag there. I still think it's gonna be cheaper going this way. Holy crap, bros. This airlock is actually pretty intense. I think we've got what, like possibly four more. Really hope we brought enough. Okay, another box here. Yeah, he's just loaded with comps. 35 tech trash, pretty great for a solo player. Let's keep it going. I think we've got two doors left. We might have to actually come back here with some more stuff. On another box. Let's go. 29 rockets. Just what we needed. We're completely out of stuff here. Let's send these last few rockets on this door. Looks like we're headed to the center here. Center triangle at least. It is a circle in here. Let's go TC. Finally. Not gonna lie. That one had me super nervous if we brought it enough. Let's take the CC. Put a door up and then we'll check the loot. Come on, let's see some sulfur. Let's go, 18k sulfur, 80 explosives there. So an awesome profit, especially finding those 29 rockets. Let's go, exactly what we need for the start of the wave. Okay, so this could be huge, boys. We're going all out on a clan base. This early in a wave could be a bad decision, or they could be loaded up in there. And check out this cheeky little raid base that I've built. We've actually got an auto turret on the top to cover from counters. But the door on this base is over here on the left side. And then if you check out this right side. Yeah, he's actually got turrets there. But there's an armored wall right next to a sheet wall. So I want to go ahead and send some rockets on that sheet wall. Damage the armored one as well. And we're going to go straight into the back of this one. Hopefully the rockets will kill that turret too. Actually, I don't think that my rockets are going to hit that turret. We'll have to deal with it later. Let's go ahead and explode out. First of all, there we go. That should be the only turret bothering us. I know there is that one over there. We could leave that in case counters flank around the other side. Let's stick to the plan here. We'll send eight rockets and see what it's looking like in the back. There we go. What do we got? It's armored. Well, that could be into the center there. We do have some C4 to use. Are we gonna get deleted by a turret here? We might just send it. Oh, that's pretty lucky. And there's actually sleepers sticking out through the wall. So that's some great and bad news there. This could be in straight to the loot, but it is armored. Shotgun traps, boxes. This is knob clan. Decent amount of comps there. And that is TC, not even locked. Let's go. Looks like we definitely made the right decision there going for this base. Now let's see if it was profit. Saw the comps there looking pretty decent. Expo ammo, tons of it as well. 24 C4, 38 rockets, let's go dudes. So we basically doubled, maybe even tripled our stuff there. Still have TC to check.
few more boxes back here as well. Pet, you played armor. Looks like these guys are lacking on weapons. Must not be the best PVPers for sure. And TC's got a bit more juice in there. Not a jackpot in the TC per se, but we did get a jackpot in the first second box we checked with all the rockets and C4. Is there anything else left in here? I mean, that's an airlock assuming going to the front door. Rated. Easy. What is that supposed to mean? Well, okay. Well, I'm extremely happy with that. Check that out. First day of wipe loot. We're going to be doing some huge stuff this wipe. Make sure to stay tuned, guys. We're definitely going to be hitting a huge clan tomorrow. Get subbed, and I will see you guys very soon.